Hey, what's up everybody? I'm Scavenger. Welcome to today's video where I am going to do the top five games. Now, this top five games is not going to be the, the ones that I have chosen as my top five. I've already done a blog post on that, and if you want to check them out, you can do so at scavenger.com. Just the, the same way you spell my name, Scavenger with a 3R and not an ER. All right, so you can check that out. But this top five is going to be the top five games on my channel. And here's how this works, okay? I've gone over the analytics. I've gone over the biggest games on the channel by views. So what I've done is I've looked at my most viewed videos. And the five games with the most views is how I've chosen this list. So we're going to do this from the fifth game all the way to the very first and, and most viewed game. All right. so. Let's go ahead and get into today's episode. All right, so the first game in the list, so this is going to be a number five spot, is which might surprise you, not an adult game. So. Uh, it's weird that it made it in the top five, but it is King's Choice, which is a mobile game. And um, after looking it up, it's kind of described as an RPG game. But I would say it's uh, like a RPG slash dating or, or harem game where you're you're finding different women or men to be a part of your your kingdom. I'm gonna say harem because that's basically what it is. You just have a whole bunch of beautiful or stunning men or women that you collect and they help you out somehow they give you some sort of stats but then you can do other stuff you can raise heirs and then you have fights with um neighboring countries or whatever but it, it's also kind of like a a multiplayer where or uh, not multiplayer but yeah whatever we'll call it multiplayer where where you can actually team up with other other players online to suppress other kingdoms whatever you know the type of mobile game. There's there's a lot of them out there. King's Choice is just one of them. Anyway, that comes in at number five as like one of the most viewed games on the channel. So there you go. All right. So coming in at number four is Being a Dick, um, which doesn't surprise me. Being a Dick is a pretty popular series. I actually expected it to be a little bit more popular on the channel because of the popularity of the game itself. But I've come to find that that's not always the case um, when it comes to viewership. But whatever, it's a great game. I suggest if you haven't heard of it, which I doubt that that's even possible. I think everyone's heard of Being a Dick. But if you haven't heard of it, if you don't know what the game is, go check it out. It's pretty freaking fun. And there's two seasons out right now. I think, actually, if you're a Patreon uh, for uh, Dr. Pink Cake, I'm pretty sure Season 3 just released. Or will be very shortly from the date of this video. All right, now moving on to number three. The number three spot is Fresh Women. Fresh Women, um, I played this several months ago when, um, before it was released on Steam and when there wasn't really a whole lot of content. I played the first, uh, I probably did like three videos maybe. can't remember exactly how many I did. But, uh, you know, it, it got some views and everything, but really didn't take off as far as viewership until a couple things happened and I only thought it was one thing but then I was informed that two things happened which really boosted the viewership and put it up in the, the three spot on the channel and that is uh, one it was released on Steam but right around the same time uh, MXR plays played Fresh Women and that's probably where I really got my viewership for that and that's what threw it into the three spot was the fact that they probably, uh, you know, drove some views over to the channel. So uh, it is a fun game. If you want to know my thoughts on it, you can check out the tier list, which I just posted a video on uh, not too long ago. I'll put that. I'll put a link to the tier list in the description below too. Um, but yeah, first one, pretty good game. I recommend it as well. And then uh, number two, number two spot. And actually, this one would be the number one spot if I took all the views from all of the, the the series and added it up. But that's not how I did this list. And that is Summertime Saga. Uh, one of the most amazing games I've ever played. Also on my tier list. If you want to hear me talk about it more, 
but uh, definitely worth a play. And it's totally understandable why this game made the top five. Which brings us to the number one game, the most viewed game on the channel, which blows my mind. I don't know why, I don't know how, but the number one spot, the highest viewed game on the channel right now is Tentacle Locker. I don't know how. I don't, it's not really even like a good game. <laughs> um, it, it, it's a very simple... Uh, uninvolved very easy um there, there's no there's no story there's nothing there's nothing i don't i don't know why it's so popular i don't want to shit on the developer but based on all the other games i don't i i, I mean i do i do know why this one got popular but uh yeah the the, the game i've only i've only done one video on tentacle locker and then i did like a video on tentacle locker 2 uh cuz there's two of them um, but Tentacle Locker, the first one, is the one that's in the number one spot with over a million views. That's the only video I have that by itself has broken a million views, but it's crazy. Yeah, yeah, and Tentacle Locker is not a game that even made my tier list. I wouldn't, I wouldn't rate it because, like I said, it's there's no story. There's nothing to it. Um, I don't know if you'd consider arcade style. Not, I don't know. I don't know what you consider it. It's just something fun to waste a few minutes, but that's about it. But I mean, it gained its popularity probably because of its gotcha style of animation or characters. And at one point, somewhere, somebody made a TikTok, and that one TikTok went viral. And anytime, anytime something goes viral somewhere else on the internet, if you've already done something uh, on the topic, you're probably going to get some of that wave of uh, viewership towards you. And that's what happened with Tentacle Locker because that uh, once that TikTok went viral, um, that video also skyrocketed up to over a million views in like no time. Um, but, I mean, because of that, it gets a number one spot for most uh, like for the top five games on my channel um kind of a technicality i guess because does it deserve it does it deserve the number one spot i mean based on the category and the criteria i put for this list i guess so but probably not the best game but uh you know what that's it is what it is now you know the top five games on my channel again if you want to know like what my top five games are what i like i did post that on scavenger.com if you want to see a video on that, you can let me know. But I just figured I would do a blog post instead. Anyway, that's all I got for you guys. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time. Bye-bye.